What's up guys? Hello and welcome to another Maker Monday. Today we're going to be looking at a few different things. Some cool uh, things I saw while I was out Christmas shopping as well as getting into uh, some other things about where the videos are going and whatnot. So well, let's go ahead and get started. Grab a drink or something and sit down and here we go. Okay today what we're going to be looking at is uh, I was going through Christmas shopping because it's that time of the year and I was going through and I saw a lot of cool stuff in the smart home uh, section of different places and whatnot and thought it might be some cool stuff for the channel. First up is I checked out the Samsung water leak detector. This was actually kind of a cool looking little uh, device basically it checks to see if uh, you know water is pooling somewhere like on the ground or something um, and it'll basically send you an alert and that got me thinking we could maybe make something sort of like that for a home assistant uh, they show it like being sat next to like a dishwasher uh, they see it being put like under the sink or something like that where you know water could be spraying out because maybe you got a leaky faucet or maybe you got a leaky you know toilet or something you put it like behind the toilet where you can't see it and, and that way it'll definitely let you know if you have a, a, a leak and so that got me thinking and I was like what other kind of cool sensors like that could we have and the first thing I thought of that's something that uh, would be helpful if you were notified of it you know if you weren't at home and that made me think of smoke detectors you know how many how many of us have smoke detectors right everybody right all of us have smoke detectors <clears throat> and you got to make sure and change your batteries and things like that right well what if we could have a smart smart smoke detector that would basically tell you that there is smoke going on because a lot of times what's more devastating is if you are not in the house now it's usually a good thing that you're not in the house during a fire because obviously you know you you're safe and everything from it but at the same time if there's a fire in your house going on and you don't know it your whole house could burn to the ground before you even know what's going on before you even get notified um so that's where it would be kind of nice if you had a smoke detector and a lot of people have you know the smart cameras and stuff if you have smart cameras inside your house you could get alerted to hey there was smoke detected you could go look on your smart camera and see what was going on and then you could notify the fire department maybe uh before he, anything gets going you know i mean it could be a pretty cool deal so i was looking into it and it looks like a good smoke detector basically uh, uh, sensor would be the MQ2 sensor. So that's one that uh, you can pick up early, re relatively cheap. Let's try that again. Relatively cheap from Amazon. Um, I'll even put a link down in the description to all the stuff that I'm talking about. But um, there's one of those sensors out and we could basically build some sort of a uh, smoke detector that could send you an alert either through email uh, maybe text message maybe or maybe even a push notification um, if I can get that to work in home assistant so I don't know some cool ideas so there's some neat ideas you might be seeing a uh, another poll for videos and that may be on the list because I was thinking that would be something that was actually kind of cool you know also we got Christmas coming up and yes I was sent this by a uh, person that watches uh, the channel and basically found me on Facebook and sent this to me it's basically a little Christmas tree made out of circuit boards and stuff um, I'm gonna be putting this together so stay tuned for that I'll be showing you how to get this and I'll be showing you how I put this together and whatnot so that's gonna be our Christmas special coming up so that's something to look forward to as well as the home assistant dashboard I know you guys have been waiting a long time for that I've been having all kinds of trouble I don't know why with my TiVo little monster has not been wanting to print correctly I had to change out the entire nozzle and wouldn't you know it you can't buy the same nozzle like you have to buy a completely different one and you can't find the tips the tips are are, are some special tip I have ordered so many different tips none of them are the same the plastic squirts out all around the tip it's it's becoming a big problem and the, and, and the reason that it's becoming a big problem is because I have to have that big of a printer to print the bezel that's going to go on the home assistant dashboard to make it look cool so I sent out a poll as you guys know those of you that watch and keep up um, with things and basically have the bell rung so if you haven't rang the bell or if you haven't subscribed definitely hit that subscribe button down there and ring the bell so that way you get these polls and my basically messages that I send out to you guys make sure you hit that ring that bell button you know basically there's a little bell icon those of you that don't know next to the subscribe button and make sure you click that and turn on your notifications okay so make sure and do that but basically uh, 
you guys said that I was like, I, I we could either wait for me to get this stupid thing fixed, which is taking longer than I imagined, so I apologize for that, or I could release the video in two pieces. You know, basically one piece would be how to actually configure the 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 dashboard and put all the different pieces together and how to do all that and then the next video would be putting it all into a package and showing you how to you know mount it to a wall and make it look all nice and everything like that so a lot of you said that yes you would like to see it uh uh, in two videos instead of holding out for the whole thing. So, because I knew you guys were excited about it because I did that one poll uh, asking what should be our next video and you guys highly recommended the Home Assistant Dashboard. So, um, I think that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to split it in two videos. So, hopefully that will be coming up uh, as well. Hopefully this month or in the next uh, week or two, you should be seeing that as well as then the Christmas video will be out, you know, probably that week of Christmas or something like that. I do try to stick to a one video a week as much as I possibly can and then if we get maker mondays in there um is great i may miss some maker mondays sorry about that if i do but you know it's just as time goes doing two videos a week is actually a lot for me so um i try to keep my video schedule and how do you guys like the video release schedule let me know down in the comments i try to release it on wednesday so it's kind of in the middle of the week but you know i was thinking if i do a maker monday generally should i wait till thursday it'll give you maybe two days or so um before one comes out or do, do you like the wednesday you know i, I don't know i don't know let, leave your leave your comments i'm curious about that so so let me know down in the comments if if, if wednesday is is a better deal and i usually do it around noon looks like the majority of you looking at my analytics uh view it around noon so i uh i do that uh, uh around noon or so just judging by the analytics but let me know down in the description uh if that should change uh enough of you you know uh, do that, then maybe uh, may, maybe I'll, I'll, I'll move it around, try to accommodate. So uh, let me know what your thoughts are. And in another set of news, I finally got um, some people on Patreon. So uh, thank you very much. You know who you are. Uh, they even they were a legendary uh, patron. So they're going to be getting a box of swag. Sorry that it's taking me so long, but um, getting the uh, there's a piece of it that I want uh, to give you that uh, hasn't actually I'm, I'm kind of out of at the moment. So it is coming. You know who you are. Your box of swag is coming. Those of you that don't know, I do have a Patreon. Okay. And there are two different tiers one is the epic uh tier and then there's also a legendary tier and one is the one dollar one and the other one is the five dollar one it all helps out the channel so if you want to go there and sign up uh, if you like what i'm doing here and you want to support uh, what we're doing here is so i can get uh, more things more items buy more raspberry pies or buy more whatever to bring you guys uh, more videos with more uh, stuff that you can buy or if you like just the cool sensors and the cool gizmos and whatnot that way i can buy those and show those to you um, check out my patreon page uh, and uh, support there if you wish as well as the uh, links in the description to amazon uh, that helps support the channel as well and other things like that but if you'd like to really get into it and get some exclusives uh like exclusive uh uh, contests and maybe some exclusive content I'm still working on what the exclusive contents gonna be uh, but I'll put it together and put that on to patreon so if you guys like what we're doing here check me out on patreon and I'd love to have you and thank you very much for those that have signed up already on patreon so anyway uh, the next bit of thing that I'm gonna be looking at is uh, the uh, contest that we ran I only had like three comments I was kind of disappointed I figured you guys would want to get in on that so anyway I'm gonna be giving away that uh, DF Robot Curie, okay, which is a pretty cool little deal. In fact, they're actually fairly expensive. So um, this is a good chance to get one if you enter the contest. So that's on the last Maker Monday I did, which wasn't last Monday. I missed that one. But it's Maker Monday episode number 52. So look up the uh, episode 52 and you can enter a comment. All you gotta do is just put a comment down there. What would you use it for? Or just comment at all. As long as you comment, I'll uh, I'll be able to uh, pick, up, uh, pick up your name and I'll be able to draw your name out of a hat and we'll see who wins so i'm gonna leave that open for another week just because some of you may not have uh talked about it or something and i may release a, a message out you know as like a reminder uh, throughout the week uh that, that that contest is going on so you guys can be sure to go there and comment okay so that another reason why you need to press that subscribe button because you can't uh get in the contest unless you're subscribed okay so get that subscribe button push and hit that bell icon definitely hit the bell uh notification all right so that way you don't miss out on that contest because that's kind of cool you can get one of those those boards and those boards are are pretty powerful 
powerful and pretty cool. I used them in the uh, force uh, turn on or offer video. All right, guys, so this has been long enough. Thank you very much for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and share, and all that jazz, as well as check out some links down below. I have a link down below to a free 30-day trial of Amazon Prime. Check that out down there. That is actually really cool. I love our Amazon Prime. In fact, I don't know what we would do, especially this time of the year, without it. You get free two-day shipping. You get access to the Prime Video and Prime Movies and things like that. So if you have a smart TV or you have a, a, a Chromecast or a Amazon Fire Stick or anything like that, you get access to the Prime Video. You get access to a lot of their different books. You get discounts on stuff. You also get to work uh, or uh, get to be in on the uh, Prime Day stuff, Black Friday deals that are only for Prime customers. But honestly, for me, the two day free shipping is absolutely worth it. I have literally ordered, and sometimes it's faster than two days. I mean, two days is, a, is, is, is like the max or whatever. Sometimes I've literally ordered something and it's come in the next day. So it is well worth the money. So tell you what, don't take my word for it. Go try it out, hit that link down below. You'll help the channel out when you do that, as well as you'll get a free 30 day trial of of Amazon Prime, so go down and check that out. But guys, thank you so much for everything. Thank you so much for watching, so much for subscribing. Make sure to check out, check back uh, for definitely more videos and whatnot coming your way. And guys, we will see you next time.